It's not about me, though. You know, I, I want to do my part. If, if it's on the bench, then it's on the bench. If it's not, then I'm elated. Let's win the game. How big do you think continued home field is for you guys when looking at it, coming into it, that wasn't guaranteed? Huge, huge. You know, that's why towards the end of the year when we're kind of jockeying with Philly and first was out of our reach, but we said, listen, we want to get that two spot because you never know what can happen. And the way that it's set up where they kind of split the teams apart, once New York loses, then, you know, it's kind of all set up for us. So, and the format's a lot quicker, it's a lot shorter, but um, if you get things in your favor, you can be in a really good spot. Did you watch Toronto and NYCFC last night? And just kind of additionally, just like what is Toronto, what, what are the dangers that they present? They're dangerous all over. I mean, I think the one thing that they have is in every position on the field, they've got experience, you know? It's kind of a calmness. You can look at every single guy in that 11 and say, yeah, he knows what he's doing. Um, and that's tough. Every single time since 2017 we've played them, it's been a difficult game. And I expect nothing different on Wednesday. There's been, I'm sorry if you've been asked this, there's been so much shuffling on that back line. What can you just say, no matter kind of yeah. who comes in or out, you guys just keep seeming to perform back there? It's professional, you know, performances. Flo's got plenty of experience. Mikey, although he has been playing with us, has been playing a lot of time with the twos. And that, that's a testament to that setup, to give him that opportunity. And um, like I said, Mikey's a gamer. He's going to step in and do his job, and he did great tonight. What's your level of confidence at this point in postseason? Well, we take it game by game. You know, we don't want to get too ahead of ourselves. I, th I think that we like, when we step into this room before a game, we like our chances. We look around at each other and we say, well, we've got a pretty solid roster here. We can do something. So um, it's not... You know, it's not overconfidence, but I think we, we feel good about each other and, and whenever we're in this building, it's always a good thing. Talk about Joseph finally hitting the back of that, the net. You know, he had a couple opportunities and then didn't score in the last match. Well, I fell over when he scored his goal tonight because that was outrageous. Um, more of a hopeful ball from Julian, but it gets over McKenzie's head and Joseph just puts it in the top of the goal. Like, I honestly... You'd have to say that was his hardest chance tonight, maybe, but yeah, I fell over when he scored it.